We've been playing together for a while now. I was wondering... Are we friends? <laughs> okay, this is a little creepy, but... Yeah, we're friends. Sure. I agree. There's no reason a human and a machine can't be friends, right? I mean... Yeah. I'm glad you said yes. <laughs> Alright. Not gonna lie, it's a little creepy. And now she's looking around all... Sketchy like. But what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Detroit Become Human. Wait. Oh. Are you sure you should continue? Yeah. Maybe... Maybe we should leave things as they are. Um... <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> it's cool, but it's weird. As you wish. Yes, we're going to continue, my friend. When we last left off, we were Connor, and we had just found the evidence we needed to know where Jericho is. And we knocked out that one guy, can't remember his name at the moment, but that other agent who's going to kill us, we knocked him out. And Hank beat up the FBI, the guy in charge at the FBI, which was pretty funny, as a distraction to help us. So he's definitely our friend. I wonder who we're going to start out with this time. I'm guessing Kara, probably. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's start out with Kara, 9.34 p.m. We're going to cross into Canada, I think. Isn't she driving? Is none of us drive? Oh, these are like automatic. Okay. Oh, oh media. You know, I never noticed that. Like when we're in these cars, I, th I always thought like at least one of the people were driving. It's cool. It's autonomous. Wonder if we'll have cars like this someday. They've been conducting raids all over the city. Everybody's on edge after what happened yesterday. It's crazy. It's gonna be all right. We're almost there. Because of Marcus. There's a revolution. Got Alice and Luther in the back there. She's taking a nap. What do do with this? With all androids being turned over to the authorities, the country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing, water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Maybe most worrying of all, our armed forces have lost two-thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead? <laughs> sure. Sure, Rose. Whatever you want. You're helping us. Let's go, Alice. We got gotcha. you. So what are we doing? A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The oh. last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? And be careful. Take care of them. So we're going to be joining up with Come Marcus. It's interesting. Better not hang around. We have a bus to catch. 
Alright, which way are we going? Find Jericho. Locate Jericho. Alright. Is this gonna be like the same way Marcus found it? This doesn't look like the same place though. So I guess let's try going. Uh, actually that looks blocked off. Yeah, alright. Let's go this way then. Connor. Oh god. What's gonna happen here? This is so exciting. Is he gonna find it before we do? Well, I don't have to pick sides. I'll definitely pick Kara's side if I have to. Between Marcus and Connor, though, I don't know who I'll pick. I like both of them. So many people here now. I need to protect Alice. Gotta find a warm place for Alice. She's the only human here. They're conducting raids across the city. Oh, over here. Here's a fire. It's kind of a. It's a big android. Is it bigger than Luther? About the same. But they were made to lift heavy loads as well. How do you feel? I'm hot and cold at the same time. That's not good. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Carol, there's something I have to tell you. It's about Alice. Yeah, he was about to tell us this earlier. We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. Oh, come on. I'll be back. I want to know. Stay with Alice. He knows something we don't. I'd like to know what it is, honestly. Oh, God. He made it. Connor's here. Dude. Oh, I guess they out of cars, way. Don't catch anyone's attention. Connor? I probably shouldn't do that. Let's go upstairs. You're lost. You're looking for something. She's smart. You're looking for yourself. And scary. Alright, Rebecca's car. This is cool. Switching back and forth like this now. I wonder if we could see Connor if we were down there. Alright, we gotta find Marcus. Oh, there he is. Are you Marcus? I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. 
Maybe you're right. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports you can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? She's not like all of them. They're not all the same. No different secret. Thought. She needs me. Then I need her. It's as simple as that. So he's under the impression every human hates all androids. I don't think that's the case, honestly. I just want to go back down to Alice and Luther. I'd like to know what Luther is trying to tell us about Alice. It's crazy that they're all here in one place. I literally had no idea. Are we gonna talk to her about it? That's why she was saying we'd hate her if she told us. That's crazy, man. I never would have guessed that, honestly. I mean, she never wanted to eat. I guess that could have been a giveaway. I never thought about that. I just thought she had too much on her mind. We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. All we did was show them who we really are. I don't want war, but I'd rather die free than live as a slave. What's the point of being free if no one is left alive? Maybe my judgment was clouded by anger. 
But everything that I did was for our people. This is getting us nowhere. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? Confrontation, dialogue. I know she's gonna want a confrontation. He's probably want to hide. I think dialogue would be talking to them. Ah, man. I'm just gonna go dialogue. Dialogue is the only way. Yeah. I will go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't do this, Marcus. They'll kill you. Maybe. But North, I have to try. If I don't come back, lay low as long as you can. They need to realize how much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. Sad, angry, thoughtful, bitter. Is this what we dreamed of? They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it and to give me the detonator. A wow. dirty ball. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. You know what? I'll keep it. I just hope we never have to use it. Yeah. Whatever happens tomorrow. Love I just want you to know that I... I'm glad I met you. Kiss her. Awesome. Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. Even though we haven't picked her side, the things that she's wanted to do, she still loves us, so that's awesome. We've gotta win this. become a deviant <laughs> well done Connor you succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader oh is this now all in his head Marcus. we need it alive this is in his head no way I'm learning all kinds of stuff oh god it's about to go down I've been ordered to take you alive But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Reason defy, discourage threat. What are you doing? You're one of us. You can't betray your own people. Intimidate instruction. You're coming with me! You're Connor, aren't you? Famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you were looking for. You're nothing to them. You're just a tool they use to do their dirty work. But She's you're more than touch that. Them. 
We're all more than that. Stay back, warning shot enough. Say nothing. Shutouts, question undermined. Have you never wondered oh, who so you really doubt. are? Whether you're just a machine executing a program or a living being capable of reason. I think the time has come for you to ask yourself that question. Do you never have any doubts? You've never done something irrational? As if there's something inside you? Something more than your program. It's time to decide. Yes! We're gonna be a deviant. Oh, here we go. It might be harder for him. He's more of an advanced model. They're going to attack Jericho. What? We have to get out of here. Shit. I love this. Crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long. Oh, God. Here we go. The end of Jericho. Save our people, Marcus. I won't leave you! 
There are no. Come on, Luther. Can't leave you behind. in danger. Go now before they come back. What about you? What are you going to do? I manage. Alice is all that matters. I don't want to leave you, Luther. Don't worry. I'll catch them through the border, okay? Go now. Take care of each other. Damn. Alright. Are we gonna hide? Probably gonna regret this. Oh. She didn't live anyway. We should have just left a shot, probably. Down there. Follow me. Oh my god. They are everywhere, dude. Please don't kill us. Don't hurt us. We haven't done anything wrong. Please. Shut up. Put your hands on your head. We can't take them. Sorry. Squad out. Tango. Jump. Five. Stop. I think we're okay. Look out! There they come! Don't move! We surrender! We surrender! Don't shoot! I think we can help these ones. Marcus! It's Marcus! Go now! Join the others! Join you later. Oh, yeah. We're safe, Alice. Run. Stop. Okay. Oh. No. Play dead, run, surrender. Play dead. Get down. Don't move. You're moving. So still. Oh, my God. Defend Alice. Don't move. Please don't kill me. Oh my god. Close your eyes. Come on, let's get out of here. <sighs> oh my god. This is stressful, dude. Should we get up now? I think they're gone. Yeah, 
If we would have just kept running, we would have gotten shot for sure. Gotta blow up Jericho. today. Let's go. Marcus. Bomb's gonna explode any second. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, for saving north. Oh shit! Ah, that was hard. Oh my god, I'm feeling him. Jinx myself. Over there, run! Go now! Connor, let's go, Connor. an explosive in the hole. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. It's it over, Marcus? No, you're right. It ain't. Oh, dude, that was like... That was literally one of the best ones so far. There's probably a million outcomes for this one. Look at all that. I'm gonna spend a few minutes looking at these. I just want to. I just find it interesting to see who picked what. Look at all that, dude. This is the longest one ever. All right, world stats. Josh jumps with him north. Connor. So one other person could have jumped right there. Hmm. Connor protects Marcus and North. I love that part. I like that Connor's with him now, honestly. In the hold with Marcus. That was insane. Oh, uh, okay, so there's different ones. Press R1 to view Connors. Oh, wow. That's crazy. Spot Kara. We missed a lot of stuff there. Stopped by Lucy. Threaten Marcus. Confront Marcus. 100% became deviant? Or is that, oh, it's for instead. 
world stuff. Okay, seventy eight percent became deviant. That's awesome. Yeah, we're gonna have to play this again, dude. That's it's crazy. Seven thirty one PM. Where are we? Oh, is this Carl's house? Oh dude. Forgot about Carl for a minute, not gonna lie. Wonder if he'll even Alarm deactivated. Welcome home, Marcus. <laughs> it still works. Wonder if he even wants anything to do with us now. I mean, we did kill his son, so that's not good. Let's see, Carl. It's probably in here, right? Wait, what is that? Hi, Dad. I'm getting out of the hospital tomorrow. Oh, he you left. You stayed with me while I was asleep. I, uh, I'm really sorry about everything that happened. I'm gonna stop all that shit. Uh, it messes me up, it, it turns me into somebody I hate. Hey, I, I'd like to come by and, and see you tomorrow, if, if that's alright with you. Dude, don't tell me he's coming back while we're I, here. We need to just I'll leave. Let you know. I'm, I'm proud to be your son. When was this message? Oh, I didn't read it. He said tomorrow he wants to come over. Oh. He might just be upstairs in the bed. Or he could be in his office. Or his little... his painting room. Must be asleep. Hopefully he doesn't hate us too much. I don't think he will. Honestly, I think he was telling us to run, right? Means he cared about what happened to us, so. Although maybe his opinion has changed with us being on the news everywhere. Not sure. Guess we're about to find out, though. If he's even here. Who are you? Oh, How did he, you get in? He replaced I them. need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to leave. Is he gonna free him? Oh my god. Carl might need this guy though. Please. I need to see him. He's very weak. I'm not sure he'll be able to talk to you. We gotta try. Carl. Oh, Marcus. I was hoping you'd come. I missed you so much, Carl. You don't know how much I miss you. What's wrong, Marcus? You taught me everything I know, but I wasn't prepared for this. I thought we would win because our cause was just. I realized just how wrong I was. World is ruled by fear, Marcus. Fear of others. Fear of the future. It's like me, too old. It's time for a damn. What should I do? Carl, they're killing my people. I, I don't want to answer violence with violence, but tell me, what choice do they give? Being alive is making choices between love and hate, between holding out your hand or closing it as a fist. I don't have any easy answers, Marcus. You have to accept the world as it is, or 
fight to change it. You're my son, Marcus. Our blood isn't the same color. But I know part of me is in you. When the world falls into darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. Face the abyss. But don't let it consume you. Guess we're gonna have a decision to make here. Violence for violence? Or should we still try to be peaceful? I don't know, honestly. <laughs> I have no idea. We're we about to talk to everyone? Yep. Oh, wait. Apologize to Kara, decide Connor's fate. Okay, okay. I guess we're gonna... Is that North? I guess... I wanna talk to North, honestly. Let's talk to North first. Situation survivors live in camps. They say they don't wanna take any risks with deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps. For extermination. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. What's your system status? I'm OK. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. No, In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. I say back. Apologize to Kara. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. Is Luther? Oh, Luther's we have to gone. catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. Save our people.
to suck. I want to talk. Yeah, where's Connor? That's not Connor over there. That's what's his name? But oh, there's Connor. Okay. Decide his fate. What does that mean? He's with us. It's my fault. The humans managed to locate Jericho. I was stupid. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. Nah, we trust you, man. You You're one of us it. now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife tower? Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. Be careful. Let's go talk to this guy. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Josh. That's what it was, Josh. Well, we got everyone backing us, so... Just gotta make the right decision. Form your people of your choice. Dude, I don't even know. I don't want to do violence with violence, but almost seems like the only thing they understand. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. Supportive, all right. Launch an assault on the camps to liberate the androids. March peacefully toward the camps to pressure the authority. <sighs> Man. I mean, the public opinion, they're supportive, but they haven't done anything to help us. I feel like if we just march peacefully, we're going to lose the respect of all, all the people following us. And most of us are going to die, if not all of us. Yep, we're gonna do now, a revolution. If they want war, they'll get it. We are going to fight for our freedom, and we will succeed or die. Are you ready to follow me? Chosen our side. Don't know how it's gonna play out, but wonder how many people chose up. Uh, only thirty-nine percent. So what else? Well, what those would be? Marcus on sacred ground. I guess these would be determined by if we blew up the place before or not. Hmm. I really feel like marching there would have been a bad idea anyway. Con
Oh, that's a little chart. Oh, he didn't have anything. Have we always been able to do that? I think that's new. We can switch between them. Alright, we're going to end the video there, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.